Hi everyone, welcome again to Ms. Mary Max 73. This is actually part two of my um, previous video. And as you all can see, I actually made my way to the Pro Store in New York City. So it was absolutely amazing. Um, you walk in, well first of all, the building itself did not look like a Pro Store or a Mac Store even, because it wasn't labeled. Um, it looked like just a regular building and you have to actually go into the building and um, you don't really have to get buzzed in but um, you just have to um, like take the elevator up to the second floor it's like you're going to a doctor's building or a dentist's office because it, it's not labeled um, the only way that you'll see it is in the lobby right in the um, right on the billboard thing where they list out all who's um, least um, space in that building so that's the only way that you know so you really have to know where you're going or what you're looking for and the only reason I knew is because before I went there um, I actually went onto the Mac Pro site um, Pro site and I looked up all the stores in New York City that had that sold just pro products so anyways so obviously you saw the pictures and hope you enjoyed it as much as I did Probably not because I was actually there and it was so much fun. Um, it was like sensory overload. I'm not kidding. Oh my gosh. It was amazing. But the thing that I was really kind of bummed about was I wanted to get a few other products but they were actually ran out of the things that I wanted. So um, I only ended up getting one pigment and that was gold. Which, here it is this one right here so this is really really pretty and let me swatch this for you it's so pretty I tried to get the gold glitter see that you see that so I tried to get the gold glitter because I thought it would be really pretty if you put it on top of each other or if you put the glitter on top of this pigment but unfortunately that was one of the things that they ran out of so mm, I don't know but there you go how's that isn't that pretty oh that's I mean I think it's amazing so but then again that's me okay the other things that I got were and this is actually a pro color this is another one that I got um, I got this in the pan form. This is called Bio Green. This is also another um, pro product and it's very similar to swimming. See that? So let me swatch it right beside the gold. But I don't know. I just really like it. It's a different I don't know, I really like greens. I think um, with my skin tone, I could probably, you know, they say that brown people with brown eyes can wear anything, so I'm beginning to believe it's true. Um, and I also got another eyeshadow, and this is called Deep Damson, which is another pro product. Okay, and this is similar to Sketch somewhat, but this is a matte finish. Okay, so there's Deep Damson right there, which is a deep eggplant color. So that's Deep Damson, Bio Green, Bio Green's up here, and then my gold pigment. All right. And I actually was able to back to Mac for this one, which is why it's in the container. Okay, the next things I got were two lipsticks. Um, I got Pink Plaid, which I've been eyeing this. You can. This is not a pro product, but you can get. So you can get this at any store or counter. This is a matte, this is a matte lipstick, and I swatched this for you on this side. Alright, it's a blue 
Um, it's a pink with blue undertones. And I think usually when I go for the pinks, I usually go for the pinks with blue undertones. So that pink plaid right there. Right there. The next lipstick I bought was, and this is a pro product, but this is actually released with the, um, that color, something color. I don't remember the name of the, pro of the um, whole promotional package um, thing, but it's the, it's the product or it's the release where they have the um, MAC line filler. So this is included in this. This is called Show Orchid, okay? Show Orchid, if you have, and I kind of regretted not getting it when it was part of that thing, but I did swatch it against um, Girl About Town when it was in the store, and they're very similar. So if you have Girl About Town, then I don't really think you need this one. But again, this is a pro product, and this is a an amplified cream. So, show orchid, pink plaid. Okay. All right. So then, because they didn't have everything that I wanted, um, the guy there was actually nice enough and gave me samples. So I asked for samples of the Chartreuse pigment and the Chartreuse glitter. These are two things that I wanted, but they ran out, so I'm going to try to find it. I have to try to figure out where I can get it, um, my hands on these, because I really like them. And the other thing I tried to get was the Chartreuse paint, but they didn't have that either, so. And then the second thing that I asked for, or the third sample that I got was this one. It's called Crystal Yellow, which is very different from the Golden Lemon, which is part of their... Um, which is part of their permanent collection, I believe. But this is actually a glitter also. So it's really pretty. So, yep. Okay, now for the last thing that I got at the Pro Store. Ta-da! My makeup belt. Brush is not included. I... I got home and I just wanted to put all my brushes in here so badly so see this is all leather and it has a little metal thing with that says MAC and I put in all of my face brushes up on the top and then all of my eye and eyebrow up on the down on the bottom on the second row and then there's like a pouch here and then a little pouch here and then another like right here at the bottom. So I guess you put your kabukis or whatever in here. But I just don't want to stretch it out right now because it's so new. And it smells like leather still, so... Oh, oh but all of these brushes are, um, are brushes that I've acquired over time and mostly at the cosmetic company store. So, with the exception of maybe three brushes. My 109 which I bought at the store, and my tapered face brush, this one right here, which I got at the, um, as I, which is I got I, as a gift, um, and one of my 239s, I got that at the, at the store also, but everything else came from the CCO, so, yeah. Alright, so that pretty much concludes my Mac Pro experience. So, hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And, hope to see you guys again. Bye!